The spike in cases comes as tens of thousands more bikers continue to head to the Sturgis Motorcycle Rally. The Department of Transportation says so far more than 313,000 vehicles have entered the city. Of course, it's not just Sturgis that bikers visit each year during the rally. Kelloland's Sydney Thorson joins us live now from Mount Rushmore as she kicks off our team coverage. Good evening. I am here at Mount Rushmore talking with bikers from all across the U.S. visiting today as the Sturgis Motorcycle Rally hits day six. From what I've heard, the National Memorial is a must stop. However, this year is a little bit different for some of the bikers. Mask wearing is required in all of the buildings here, whether or not you've been vaccinated. So that means anyone who wants to go shopping, get some of the memorial's famous ice cream, or enter the visitor center must wear a mask. I spoke with two riders from Connecticut who say they did not attend the rally last year because of the COVID-19 pandemic. This is my fourth time here and because of COVID we weren't able to travel anywhere so being able to, to get out mask free and enjoy the rally was extra special this year. It's been a great time. But people seem to be enjoying their time outside, viewing the monument as well. Reporting live at Mount Rushmore, Sydney Thorson, Kelloland News.